to our video where we are going to see that how we can create our portal using ServiceNow new UI builder. I have Milap with me. Hey Milap. Hey Rash. Hey. So guys, in this video, we are going to see that how quickly we can add a footer. In the last one, we see that uh, header and logo property. And in this one, we're going to see that footer. And most of the things are exactly same. Again, we have to add a new property, new page property. And the name of this page property is Chrome footer. And again, JSON. And for that, I have already prepared a JSON. I'll just copy and paste it here. Again, I'm going to leave route as empty so that it will be applied for each and every page. Once it is done, I just need to add a footer logo. And for that, I'll again go into my experience and I'll open this admin panel. And alternatively, you can directly go from left navigation. If you just select themes, you can directly go there as well. Absolutely. So let's go from here. And here, I'll open my Panda Tech theme and I'll create a new asset. You can choose the same asset. Oh, okay. Just give me a sec. No, no, no. Asset, asset is, is you can select the same what you had it earlier. I guess this is not the one. It's we not added the like one. Panda, Panda something. Yeah. Let me search with Panda. So this one, Panda Tech logo. Yeah, and, and here, position, position is footer underscore logo, footer underscore logo, that's it, and submit. Now what I need to do is I just need to open my instance. See, our footer is here with this nice caption and this image, though I know that it is looking a bit weird where it is having this much big space. Yeah, yeah. But in so ideally, can, can you do one thing? Just remove that, uh, let's do that. So let's remove the logo from there, right? Because normally you won't have logo in the footer. So Absolutely. let's quickly go back. And uh, you have to go back to the experience. No, 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 go back to the experience. I'll show you one more thing Okay. Here. Okay. Uh, and open Chrome footer. Mm -hmm. In here, all you have to do is, uh, well, if you see, uh, yeah, just make it false and save it. We are all set. Yeah, now it's looking good. Yeah. So guys, uh, this is how quickly we can add a footer in our UI builder. That's it for this Thank video. You. Thank you.